Good morning, you guys. Um, I would give you a count. Um, I think this is day 12 or 13. I'm not really sure of self-quarantining. Um, yeah, so here we are. Anyways, look at this mess. I just want to show you guys this mess. I've been in here working and... Um, really linda like why did you even buy those um yeah i mean seriously i have no room i did buy this not too long ago another one of these but um mm, oh i've got boxes down here so what i want to do today is i'm thinking about rearranging this this area again um because it doesn't flow well yeah, I don't really like the desk being there. So, it used to be over here, but now it's over there. And thinking it's going to go over there. I got some of the bead boxes out yesterday. Because I came up with an idea um, for those eggs. Remember the big eggs that I was showing you? These right here. Um, so, I made up a couple of little um, elastic bracelets so i got beads out but what i want to do now is i got my lights my bulbs because remember i told you the cat knocked over one and it broke so i'm hoping i ordered the right the right ones so let's see if not, hmm. <sighs> that's life, all right? Yeah, get some good tape they got. Oh, goodness. All right, so I got two because two is better than one. So I can replace both of them. If they're the right thing. Good grief. I appreciate the security. Okay. Come on. Hello? Okay. Alright, how do I get into this box? Alright, I'm just going to rip it open. Hopefully this is the right thing and I won't need this box. Oh yeah. Oh, whoa. Wow. This looks huge, but maybe that's just the protective. This looks like my light. Um, yeah, I think so. It just looks so wide. I'm going to see if the, yeah, this looks, I got two of these. Anyways, I'm going to plug them up or screw them in and see if it's the right light before I open that one. Hopefully it is. Look how big that is. Wow. This is wide. All right. They are the lights that I needed. So yeah, we're back in business. I only put one up. Um, one of, I've got one new still in the box. Um, I don't know if I should change that one or just leave it. But anyways, we have light. And I'm happy. Alright, I think that's a little bit better. I've got more space. Still not a lot of space, but more than I had before. Um, yeah, I just it just flows better right in here. It was driving me nuts because I couldn't even turn around in my chair. Okay, now we can finish the crafts. Okay, I have procrastinated enough. I am going to take pictures. That means I have to move my lights over here. But um, I created this little space over here specifically for my pictures. Um, I, someone gave me this table. Let me show you what it is. It's uh, just a little end table, I guess. 
but they put hinges on it. Ugh, you don't want to see that mess. I've got faux leather in here. Y'all, I've got so much faux leather. It's, it's, ugh, it's not funny. Um, but yeah, you can store stuff in there. But um, I, originally I had my cameo on here, but now the cameo is on the desk. So I'm going to use this space for picture purposes. Um, and actually this, I guess they did this as like a shabby chic. It's not messed up, but they like, I mean, I guess that paint came off, but it's this color and it's distressed. Is that what you call it? Distressed. But anyways, I'm going to cover this part up with my photo paper here, which my photo paper, all it is, is, um, shelf liner and I bought a whole bunch of it and it looks like like um, faux wood or it looks like wood so it's faux wood so I'm going to set up a little photo station originally I had a couple of pieces of poster board with this on it but um, yeah I threw those in the garbage but you know what I know hold on just a moment so you know what we're just gonna wing it <laughs> this is temporary until I can get to the dollar store and get um, more poster board but as you can see I just clipped it right up here and it's actually just clipped onto these curtains with clothespins and then down here is where I will be setting up the bow um, on the flat surface and taking the pictures but now I have to set my lights up so give me a minute all right and then I just put my product in the middle kind of put it how I want it to look in the photo uh, sometimes I will like take like a glass container of course this one has something in it but you'll want to empty it and I will put my product on top if you want to give it a little more height where you can get a good side um, a side view shot you can use something as small as like this just something that raises it up a little bit I mean because sometimes the bows they're hard to um, get a good picture of you can also let me get this one off of here you can also get like a spool of thread or a ribbon and put it up under here where you can't see it in your photo and it just angles it a little bit more and you get a better picture but um yeah and of course you'll want to you know take your picture where all your background is not showing you just want your backdrop so but yeah you can always crop that out all right so i'm going to go ahead and take all of these pictures which i have 10 to take and um hopefully i can get these up online hopefully um my phone went dead so it took longer then I wanted it to and then of course it is so hard to take pictures of some of the bows that I make just to get the good you know you want them to see all the good angles and it's just hard so that's why I hate taking pictures that's the most time-consuming thing but these um, I'll see how many one two three four five six seven. these nine bows will go up for sale tomorrow um, I want to make one more to make it an even 10, but I don't know what what design we should do. Let's go through the ribbon. All right, here's my cart. Let me pull it over here. All right. So, out of the ribbon that I recently purchased, I'm probably getting some more tomorrow, but I want to make one tonight. Um, I don't know. I don't... I, I'm not sure about Yoda. I've got somebody that wants a Yoda bow, so I might not make that one. I might do a tangled bow because I didn't I buy a tangle or Rapunzel clay? Let me look. All right, but the clay bows, of course, they are, are more expensive. So I try to make those a little more frou frou. Let's see, I got Belle and I got Jasmine. I don't have any ribbon for Jasmine. Yeah, here we go. And I got um, Rapunzel and Ariel, which I've got to get some ribbon for Ariel too. So it's between Belle and 
Oh, forgot about that. I could have used that. Nah. All right, so it's between Belle and Rapunzel. So let me look. I think we're going to go Rapunzel. And I might make a... I don't know. I might make a, just a funky loopy bow. But I know I need to make some corker because I don't have these colors ready. All right, now I'm going to go make some corker ribbon. And we're going to make um, the tangled Rapunzel. I'm going to make the Rapunzel. Just because I want an even tin. I oh, know, that's weird. Isn't she cute though? Should I make a loopy bow? Huh. I'm trying to think. Yeah. I'm, yeah, I think so. Alright, so I'm going to go make up some corker ribbon. It is getting hot in here with these lights on. So yeah, this is the one we're going to make. I lied. I'm not going to make the tangled bow today because I think I'm going to make all the princesses at one time and upload them at one time. That makes more sense. Um, so I decided to make some triple twisters um, because I know I've had several requests for different colors and um, yeah, that's what I'm doing. I've got some, I don't know what I'm going to put in the middle of this one. Something happy that's going to go on top and then this one's going to be like a Mickey or a Minnie inspired triple twister. So yeah, that's what I decided to do. So now I don't have to go in there and make corkers. Have y'all tried this? This is so good. Um, but yeah, I don't, that was random. Um, now I can focus on getting those bows listed and yeah, I'm pretty much done for the day. It is hot in this craft room because I've got this, this right here right over me. Um, so yeah, I think I'm going to end the video for today. And I didn't record myself doing these because y'all are probably like so sick and tired of seeing me make burst bows and triple twisters. Um, but I promise in the next video we will do something different. I'm going to brainstorm tonight and we will do something totally different. Um, oh look what I found when I was cleaning. Do you guys remember this? This little, what is this little platypus? Oh my goodness, this is so old. Um, a friend of mine sent this to me many, many years ago. It's a little clay piece. It's pretty big. That is Perry from um, Phineas and Ferb. <laughs> and that is so old. That show, I don't even think it comes on anymore. Um, but I found that. So yeah, I'm about to put up some ribbon, the ones that I got out. I'm going to clean this desk. I am going to leave the craft room with a clean desk every time I shut the door. Hopefully. Um, I just feel so much better when it's clean. Um, and then I don't have to clean it, you know, when I'm starting a project. But um, I do want to package up and take pictures of the, the little eggs. I don't know. I think I showed you. I'm getting old. I can't remember. But I'm going to do an egg, an Easter egg clippy. I'm going to do um, a bunny. I've got two bunny bows left. I've got this one with the purple bow. So I'm going to do a bunny bow with the Easter egg clip. And I'm also going to do a twisted boutique bow. This is going to be for the purple. And um, for the yellow, I've got a bow right here. That's going to be for the yellow because the bunny has got a yellow bow. Um, and of course, they're all going to have three bows and a bracelet. And I'm going to package them in these eggs. Really cute. And I'm going to... I don't know how much I'm going to sell these for. They're not going to be expensive because they need to get out of here. And I wasn't even going to do these, but I had these two bunnies left. So, you know what? I don't know. $15, $20. And... Um, that would make a great Easter basket filler. 
So I'm going to um, take pictures of those, get them packaged up, and list those as well. I've only got two of those. And then I'm going to have this shop fully socked. I know it's a bad time because of, you know, what's going on in the world. But at least that's going to be done. And then I can kind of take a breather and do something do something else. <laughs> um, so yeah, but I'm going to go ahead and end today's video. Thank you guys for watching. And I'll see you in the next video.